Hello, welcome back to my channel. Um, today is Saturday, um, December the 1st, um, and it is Candle Day at Bath & Body Works, but that's not what I'm on here for. I am on here to create a look using my palette I wore, this Morphe 39A, and these are the shades, very gorgeous shades. And very fall appropriate. Okay. So I'm going to see what look I can come up with using this palette. This is gorgeous. I received this palette from a giveaway, like I said, from Naturally Adorned TV. And I'm going to see what look I can come up with. I think I want to try the greens. So let's see. First shade, I'm going to go in. And these shades, they do have names, and it came with a little plastic bin with the names on it. I haven't taped it on there yet. So, let's see. I'm going to use one of the big shades, which that first one right here. I'm going to use Bare as my transition shade. Just the very light. beige light shade and I had already done my brows already set my eyes and everything so straight to the eyeshadow but it's having a great morning so far it's it's early and like i said bath and body works having their candles on will have their candles on sale today for 8.95 so you know i am going there and also my daughter is moving so i'm going to go help her move going to the start on tonight the comedy club and that's about it shade on. I'm going to go in with a little deeper shade. Um, let's see what color that is. Evolve. That's pretty. So, Evolve is going to be my brush. Uh, Evolve is going to be this deeper shade here. So, I'm going to deepen up the crease on with it. And these um, shades don't have a lot of fallout, so that's good. Because it's raining outside. So my camera is going probably from light to dark. I'm sorry about that. I'm trying to use just natural light. Because when I use my regular lights, I always get like a glare. I mean, some what you call it. Okay, so I wanted to play in the greens. So now I'm going to go in with this green shade here. You see it? This green here. Now I don't know what this is going to look like. I don't know what no green. 
Let's see. You can see the green, not bad, but to be honest, y'all, I need to start wearing my glasses, but of course I can't put on eyeshadow while wearing no glasses. Too. It's in there, so I'm going to blend it out with this other brush. Blend those edges. Okay, I'm going to try and not focus. Okay. So I've got that blended out. Okay. So now I'm going to go in this darker green, which is right here, and deepen up my outer V. Oops. <laughs> Uh-oh. Let's see. Yeah, I'm sorry. I need to get my mirror and put it here so I can see this. I can't see to be honest with this. I do have a little fallout. You can see it probably on my face right there. But I hadn't put on any foundation, so. And that was in that darker green shade. And you know, it could be this brush I'm using. This is a profusion brush. This brush is really soft. But I do seem to see more kick up on that shade. So I'll clean it up and go back and blend. These are the greens so far. So now I'm going to, since I'm doing the green, I'm going to use this green with the I'm going to use one of the brushes she gave me. This green brush to pack on this green shade here. Y'all, this is a big palette. So I'm trying to hold it too, but I'm going to have to sit it down. because I have to pull my eye. And do the other eye. Okay. 
Okay, and let me just blend out those And if I wanted to make this green darker, I can wet my brush. I either use some glitter glue or something for it to stick to. But this is fine for me. And of course, it looks probably lighter on camera do it than it do in person too. Because I'm using just natural light. So let me do me a brow bone color. And then I'm going to put on my foundation. And I'll come back and show you the finished look of this palette. I like it. Thank you, Naturally Adorn TV. Um, let me put on your brow bone color. Um, I can't find my brush. So, let me just take a little brush. Oh, here with my brush. See? I'm going to y'all get all up. Okay, so I'm just going to take, don't have like a light shade really, so I'm going to take that same color that I use, the same color that I use as my transition color, and just put it on my brow bone. Come back with the final look, I'm going to do the bottom. Smoke out my bottom with the green and everything. Clean up all this little fallout I got and put on my foundation. And I will come back in a minute. Thank you for watching. Hold on. <laughs> 